wife's grandfather always said that uh, poor people can't afford to buy cheap things. If I have a lot of knives to work on, I'll, I'll get out there first thing in the morning and uh, start grinding away. That's one of the things I love about my job. There's no set schedule per se. It's, I know I have things to work on and things that need done and it's a, a blessing to always have work. It starts out as just a, a raw bar of steel. Each one is hand ground. It's all by, by feel and by sight. All the handles are hand cut and glued and pinned on uh, one at a time. I actually started out uh, making knives and needed something to, to put the knives in and uh, that's where the leather work started. Learned on my own and I just wanted to make more useful things, uh, things that would last. I'd say a handmade knife is always better just for the fact that uh, the maker puts everything he has, every quality that they look for in a good knife, that goes into every knife that comes out of the shop. Supporting local and, I mean, handmade, American-made, it's all uh, so important. I mean, it's a waste of money to buy uh, five of one thing for five dollars when you can get I mean, maybe pay a little bit more, but that one thing is going to last you for so much longer. Make the good investment up front and it's, it's going to pay off. A lot of people love the, the story, the character that these things build over the years and um, I think that's another reason that they, they don't want to get rid of the stuff. Art in general can, I mean, you paint a sidewalk or something and it's, it's going to catch somebody's eye, it'll, it'll make them smile, um, make them think, and to me I think that's what, what art is all about, to uh, just to touch somebody's mind in a way that normally isn't. My name is Dustin Case and uh, I'm Wooden Steel. Oh my.